back to another episode of The Shade Bro. We are in, not New York City, but the great state of California. We are in Los Angeles, Santa Monica Beach right now. We're actually midday. Uh, we started this vlog yes, about sir. six hours ago, uh -huh. but we wanted to open and show you. Wow. We're among the stars, baby. So we came here to rock the fashion. Just kidding, not at all. We're here to just rock your world. Make sure to hit that subscribe button right now. This is gonna be a four part journey. I mean, it's gonna be a lot, so it's coming at ya. Stay tuned. Jason's a master of parallel working, dude. Wow. I mean, not that he has to. No, but he can fit anywhere. Here come the Bentleys and the Lambos. Yeah. Us being bad and bougie, we made it to Rodeo Drive, where we're gonna spend a couple hundred thousand dollars. No big deal. That's right, we're going on a shopping spree at all the bougie stores, and we're gonna wipe them clean. Don't even, no, don't even look at the tag. <laughs> don't even look at the tag. 12 seconds later. Where's the dollar store? <laughs> <laughs> the, the, the dollar store? The dollar store? Yeah, yeah. Dollar. We're not in New York, but this is Saks Fifth Avenue. The world Party is New York, and then up there is Rodeo Drive, so Let's go, shall we? Another thing you'll notice, very expensive cars here. People come here to show off their, their whips, their fashion, and uh, just their wealth in general. And that's why we are here today. I'm gonna cola. Today, the world is your oyster. <laughs> All right, guys, we're now at the famous Rodeo Drive. You know what that means? Time to spend some money. <laughs> I want Tiffany, Chanel. Chanel. That's my fave. Okay, have fun shopping there, cause uh, <laughs> we'll leave you alone. <laughs> Yo, Jason, you actually look like you frequent this place. I, I, I'm worth like a whole million yen. Oh, yeah. you mean pesos? Uh, pesos, yeah. A uh, uh, trillion pesos. Actually, that's a lot. Trillion pesos? How much is that? I don't know. All right, once again, Eric doing Eric things. Basic. Being very basic. <laughs> yeah. We can't blame him, he's a basic bro. Wait, where did we come from? I forgot. This way, this way, right? We come from, where did we go? Where did we come from? Scratch yeah. Nope. Versace? Versace? Two cheap. Two cheap. Two cheap. How much is it? This is price is right. If you guess it right, I'll buy it for you. Oh, oh really? Yeah. It has to be within $50. No, within $100. <laughs> <laughs> within $100? Within $100. Are you serious? Within $100. Wait, 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 you I get it. Seriously? Uh, seriously. 3, 000, Two. Three, 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 three. <laughs> three, 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 three. three, three, three. <laughs> Damn, that's actually a great number. That's a good number. I'm gonna guess yeah. $1,300. $1,300? I'm gonna guess $699. Not because, you know, that number has any meaning. Let's try. Let's try. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Okay, so we're just in there. We weren't allowed to film. I didn't get it. What did you guys guess the price was? It wasn't three thousand three hundred thirty-three dollars. Overpriced. It was eleven $1 hundred dollars. I wasn't within one hundred. You could have been wearing a high heel. I could have been. I could have been rocking that. But instead, you're on that low sneaker heel. You know, it's not about the kind of shoes that you wear either. It's not about the size of your dick. You say that out loud, bro. So we decided, you know what? Better off spending our money at Chipotle. K Town, which is where we're headed next. Yeah. So Adios. we'll see you guys there. Hey guys, we're back in the hood. We're back in Koreatown. It's about dinner time, 7 o'clock. We're heading over to a Korean barbecue joint. Hopefully, the line won't be too long. LA is known for dank ass food. Asian food, Korean, Korean food. food. You know, New York City is pretty good with their Korean food. Yeah. But LA is just one of the levels. That's nothing. That's nothing. Alright, guys, so today we're doing shimak, which is chicken and beer. And we're going to Coco and Pizza Chicken and Beer Restaurant. And here are my friends who's already ready. This looks like some like uh, mafia meeting. Oh. <laughs> With the... <laughs> no camera, no camera. Okay. We ordered today the combination chimek. Jason, what is chimek? Chimek stands for chicken and mechu, which means chicken and beer. What's the appeal of Korean style chicken wings? So if you don't know yet, Korean chicken is extra extra crispy. Mm. And the sauce. It's and all about the sauce, bro. And that combination with the beer, if you don't know, it's, it's a killer. It's a killer. It's a killer. It's it's approved killer. by a foodie. Girls serve drink to men. No, 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 no. No, my man, the youngest. She's about to pour that on you, dude. So yeah, the youngest, the youngest is a sign of respect for the 
You never poured your own. Never poured. Right, yeah. right, 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 right. Bad luck. Oh, you just poured your own. Yeah. yeah. Oh. One day yeah. today. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, cheers, cheers, guys. Okay. Cheers. Bad luck. Cheers, cheers. <laughs> cheers. Cheers. One shot, one shot. No. <laughs> Go, go, go. <laughs> oh my gosh. Eva. Woo! Oh, that was really cool. We're gonna have brain freeze. Chicken moya. Chicken moya. Yes. Oh, gotta have the radish, bro. Radish. Gotta have the radish. So, Lydia, what is padak? Padak is popcorn chicken with green onions seasoned like on top. And then you can get the popcorn chicken seasoned with like the sweet and spicy sauce. It's a delicacy, uh, not delicacy, but like what is it? It's very popular with uh, cheese. <laughs> why? Why do they put scallions on top of it? Um, I think it's kind of to uh, balance the acidity and the uh, like brightness. Oh. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
We just got our order. Eric is patiently waiting. Shake Shack versus In and Out versus Five Guys. Not even the question. Not even the question. Okay. Shake Shack versus In and Out. Ooh, let's get it. All right, let's get started. Oh, that's just the regular double double. Animal style. Animal style. style. It, it, no, it was a double double animal style. Oh, okay. Yo, that bib though. Yeah. Looking sexy. I'm gonna take a double bite. Take a double bite. <laughs> you got a lot of bread. Take, yeah. a, take a little chunk of the meat. Oh, there it is. There it is. There, there, there it is. Mm. Bring it. <laughs> Man of many <laughs> words. <laughs> Cheers. <Ooh. laughs> True foodie. <laughs> Me and the rapper too. The patties are different than Shake Shack. The Shake Shack is really juicy, and that's what they're going for here. They're going for the crispy mm. crust. And now inside meat, it's just like, it's, it's very thin patty, yeah. overall. So you don't get that juice overflowing. So it's, just, it's, it's actually kind of healthier, in that sense. Oh, I like the bread better than Shake Shack. Oh, the bread? Oh, I don't know. I like the crispy bread. The bread is pretty good. Shake Shack, it's, it's like wet. It's wetter. It's buttery. I don't think you like the buttery. Thing. Yeah, yeah, you probably don't. It tastes fresher. Consciously. It does taste fresher. Yeah. The meat wise, Shake Shack. The yeah. meat wise, Shake Shack. 100%. 100%. Yeah. 100%. But the fries, you can't beat the fries here, though. Oh, shake Shack fries are pretty good. No, you can't, beat the, you can't beat the fries here, though. It's, you see the potato going into the machine. Yeah, but the crinkle Shake Shack fries are pretty good. No, I gotta agree with John. Dude, the fries are here. It was like probably hand picked from the garden. In, put it in that machine and on your plate within 30 minutes. We're gonna eat now. See you in a bit. Downtown. This no, Hollywood Boulevard. Hollywood Boulevard. <laughs> <laughs> I had one job. I had one job. <laughs> You have so many friends and girlfriends. So that's not us. Oh, <laughs> this is life post COVID, guys. Mm. I mean, it's still going, but people are excited to be out traveling again. And I'm just happy to be with my best friends, Earth, Wind, and Fire. Yeah. Can you, can you, can you not? Stop following me. Yeah. <laughs> Eric, you're looking like a snack, bro. What about me? You looking like a uh, animal style. Oh. <laughs> All right. Okay. Give me the uh Appa. Appa. Give me the open up. Appa. Oh. Appa. I think Appa. Appa. Tomot, tomot. Appa. All right. All right. <laughs>